Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. I'm Cynthia Newsom. This is 41 Action News. Four Sweet 16 teams will battle it out tonight at the Sprint Center. First up, Auburn versus the University of North Carolina. And then Houston takes on Kentucky. No local teams are in the Sweet 16 this year, but Kansas City will have a big economic impact. Visit KC is predicting a $10.6 million economic boost over the weekend. Hotels downtown and the plaza area are extremely busy, but there are still rooms available. Well, today marks the first day of the Planet Comic Con at Bartle Hall. The event features more than eight football fields of celebrities and comic artists and vendors and of course fun celebrity guests include the current voice of Mickey Mouse also Bonnie Wright who played Jenny in Harry Potter is going to be there and the big guest William Shatner of Star Trek a tragic story in Sugar Creek Missouri a pedestrian hit by a car did not survive the deadly crash happened around 4 30 this morning on northbound 291 near Kentucky Road the highway was closed during the investigation. It's open now. Your weather is next. Are you getting ready to sell your house? Did you know a realtor can provide an objective point of view on what repairs need to take place before you sell to get the best price? Visit KCRAR.com to find a realtor near you. I'm meteorologist Gerard Jabalia. We're going to continue to track showers and thunderstorms moving across the area through this afternoon. Flood watch is in effect until 7 a.m. Saturday. That's mainly south and east of the Kansas City metro, including Clinton, Sedalia, Warrensburg, those areas to the south. We also have a small severe threat, marginal risk of severe thunderstorms, where a few of them could produce some hail or some gusty winds near 60 miles per hour. Overall, this is going to be a rainmaker, so showers and thunderstorms likely on Powercast as we keep some pretty Pretty chilly temperatures in the 40s to the south may reach the 60s, giving them a little bit more energy where they can get bigger, producing more heavy rain and again could become severe. But for the Kansas City area, just a lot of rainfall could lead to some spots with some patchy flooding here. So we'll be watching for that. Meanwhile, it'll continue into the overnight hours until around uh, Saturday morning where we'll see almost a transition, likely seeing some of the rain showers uh, tapering off and actually becoming snow showers before all is said and done. We're not expecting them to really accumulate on anything, but some snowflakes possible on Saturday morning before we finally dry up and we will we'll see the sunshine the rest of the weekend. Remember to get all your latest news and weather updates anytime on KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.